Every year, thousands of military men and women are deployed overseas to serve our country. Finding homes for their pets while they're gone can be really, really challenging. Luckily, a married military couple, Lieutenants Elisa and Sean Johnson, decided they would do something to help their fellow soldiers. Take a look. Military Lieutenants Elisa and Sean Johnson adopted their dog, J.D., when they were still newlyweds. When we brought J.D. home, we could not be happier. He completed our family. Unfortunately, when the couple was deployed at the same time, they had to find a home for J.D. while they served abroad. That is when we realize that other military members must go through this too. And that's the last thing you need to worry about before you deploy. That's when they decided to start the nonprofit organization, Dogs on Deployment. Their charitable website matches soldiers' dogs with foster homes. Their program was an instant success. In only two years, they've helped find housing for over 225 dogs. It means so much to us to know that we're helping so many fellow military members. One success story is Jess Jimson. I deployed to Afghanistan 12 months ago, and on top of all the stress of getting ready to go, I had to find somebody to look after Emma. Through Dogs on Deployment, Jess met Sylvia. Sylvia offered to serve as a foster parent to take care of Jess's dog, Emma, until she got back from her tour of duty. I get to see Emma today, and I cannot wait to wrap my arms around her. Oh my gosh! Please welcome Jess home! And thank you so much. Don't sit down, because I got to give you a little respect now. Sean <laughs> and Elisa, give it up for those guys. <laughs> I think what you are doing is absolutely amazing. And I love the fact that you had a thought and you took action and you did something about it, because it really makes a difference. So thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> awesome. OK, Jess, how long has it been since you've seen Emma? It's been 12 months. Uh -huh. 12 months. Right. I deployed oh from uh, Joint Base Lewis McCord in August of 2012 and turned her in uh, August 3rd. Oh. So it's been over 12 months now. Just you saying <laughs> turned her in really makes my heart sink. Like, I can't even imagine being away from my dogs for that long. How's uh, it been for you? It's been hard. Really hard. She's, I've had Emma since she was eight weeks old, so she's, oh, baby. she's my baby. <laughs> um, and it, you know, being deployed is hard enough, but not, you know, not having her close by, not having your loved ones near you is the hardest thing. Oh, I'm so glad you came home. Thank you. So glad you came home. So tell me, how did you hear about dogs on deployment? Before I deployed, I did some research to get ready for the move and everything else, and did some Googling and found, uh, found out about dogs on deployment through Google. Got an email from Alyssa. She introduced me to a couple of volunteers in the area, and I got matched up with Sylvia, and met Sylvia, and we went from there. Now, how, you checked in on on Emma while you were gone. How'd you do that? Mostly through Facebook. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> through Facebook. S Sylvia was uh, Sylvia was fantastic. <laughs> Look at that dog. <laughs> She set up a Facebook account for Emma and put pictures and videos up there so every day I could go in and check on her and see what she was up to and all the fun she was having with her friends. And, and <laughs> Sylvia sent videos and, and pictures and she made me a little book too. Well, God bless Sylvia. I'm so thankful that she yeah. did that for you to keep you connected to your wonderful dog. Yeah. Should I stop doing this and get you to your dog or what? <laughs> yes. <laughs> when, Please. now? Now, right now. Right now? Right now. <laughs> This is so amazing. You're welcome. Oh, you're looking a little emotional. Yeah. What's how you feeling right now? 
Look at that baby dog. Look at that baby. She's ready to go home to her mom. You know, she remembers that mama. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's been a year. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. And that's how you mess up a soldier's uniform, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, baby. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. That's what it's all about. All right, y'all, we'll be right back. Yeah.